This is Connie, and I'm back with the Bookcase.club unboxing today. I do believe I got this one for review purposes, and let's get right into it. This is what it looks like. I don't care about the address because you guys, it's all it's listed below. All right, let's just take these out so it makes less of a mess. Hey, Bob. Buddy's laying on the this bed here. This one here says the bookcase bookcase.club. One must always be careful of books and what is inside them for words have the power to change us. Cassandra Clare. She is an author of the kind of books I like. Here is all of their information if you would like to contact them or um, join their Instagram or anything. And it says here, good luck with your reading this month. Now that spring is finally upon us, you can venture outside for all of those secretive reading spots or curl up in a sunny window nook to enjoy our March selections. Read well, Katie. And Katie must be the person who boxes my stuff up all the time because that's who signs us. But she usually writes a little more personal note. And this here is, is inked into the... The card. All right, so the first book I got is The Witches of Echo Park by Amber Benson. That's what it looks like. I'll read you the back. It says, Great characters, great stories, great settings. Amber Benson's got it. Get it for yourself. That's John Scalzi, New York Times bestselling author. Dark, delicious, and devilishly intricate. A spellbinding winner. Seen in McGuire. Um, that she's a best-selling author too. I love her books actually. Unbeknownst to most humankind, a powerful network of witches thrives within the shadows of society, using the ma using its magic to keep the world in balance. But the witches are being eliminated, and we will all pay if their if their power fails. When lice, L Y S E, McAllisters, Mc, let me start that over. <laughs> when lice. McAllister's great aunt Eleonora, the woman who raised her, becomes deathly ill. Lice puts her comfortable life in Georgia on hold to rush back to Los Angeles. And once she returns to Echo Park, Lice discovers her great aunt has been keeping secrets, extraordinary secrets, from her. Not only is Lice heir to Eleonora's Victorian house, she is also expected to take her great aunt's place in the Echo Park Coven of Witches. But to accept her destiny means to place herself in deadly peril. For the world of magic is under siege, and the battle the witches now fight may be their last. Wow, this sounds really good. This sounds excellent. Let's see what they say about it, if it's the same thing. Witches help keep the world in balance. However, the world of magic is under attack, and if the witches fall, we will all pay the price. Lysi's... Lysi, maybe? I don't know how to say that word. Great aunt has been keeping secrets from her, now heir to her estate. Lysa also finds that she must join the Echo Park Coven, a destiny which places her in peril. So it's L-Y-S-E. So is that Lissy? Lice? Lissy, maybe? That sounds a little better than Lice. <laughs> Okay, the second book is awesome because it's hardcover. Look at this little itty-bitty hardcover. Isn't that cute? It's God Save the Queen by Kate Locke. The sun never rose on the British Empire. And this says, Queen Victoria rules with an immortal fist. The undead matriarch of a, of a Britain where the aristoc aristocrat is made up of werewolves and vampires where goblins live underground and mothers know better than to let their children out after dark. A world where being nobility means being infected with the plague. Side effects include undeath. Hysterica, hysteria is the popular affliction of the day, and leeches are considered a delicacy. Yuck. 
<laughs> and a world where technology lives side by side with magic. The year is 2012 and Pax Britannia still reigns. Zandra Varden is a member of the Elite Royal Guard and it's her duty to protect the aristocrat. Aristocrat. I don't. I have such a hard time with some words. But when her sister goes missing, Zandra will set out on a path that undermines everything she believed in and uncover a conspiracy that threatens to topple the Empire. And she is the key. The prize is a very dangerous struggle. All right, let's see what this one says. Queen Victoria is the immortal ruler of Britain, where the aristocrat... Aristocracy? is made up of werewolves and vampires. Zandra Varden, protector of the aristocracy, is intent on finding her missing sister, and she may uncover a conspiracy that could topple the empire. That's what this is. All right. Uh, gotta say, this one sounds a lot better, but this one sounds good too, because vampires, werewolves, stuff like that is right up my alley. So, um, I will put their information down below. I will put book dot, bookcase.club's information down below. And let's check these books out. I, I do believe that these are the better books that I've gotten from this book club. Um, usually there's one that I'm eh about and one that I like. This time I think I'll like them both. So I will talk to you in my next video. Bye-bye.